Marlins Rich Waltz along with Preston Wilson we're joined now by the Marlins hitting coach Barry Bonds let's start with a Danny Echeverria big double last night to win a game and a triple what have you seen what do you like well I like what he's doing in the batting cage right now we've made some mechanical changes with him a little bit and you know let him get to to the ball a little bit not fall back and open up his shoulder too much and um, he's been working on that for about the last three four days and his swing started to come around you know, last night he had an at bat with bases loaded it may have been a little over anxious last the last at bat he was able to drive in a big run what's the conversation like in between those two at bats well the one thing with the young hitters though you got to you got to calm them down you know they all want to you know they get a little bit nervous with one strike sometimes and just feel like they're in a hole and you know I got to keep reiterating to them that you know that pitcher's not mechanical. He can't make a mistake. Look in your zone and be ready for your zone. If you allow somebody to throw something away and then you're going to dive to it, you're going to block yourself into something else. So you guys really got to focus and not on not and really understand that the fact that this guy's a mechanical and he can't make perfect, all three perfect pitches, and you'll get one to hit. Barry, one of the questions we get around town over the last the three weeks, especially, is what's up with Giancarlo Stanton? Now he was out with an injury. He's come back. What do you see with Stanton right now, and where are you trying to? To go with him. Well, right now, you know, he had the um. Oops, sorry. And right now, he just, you know, he's had that oblique problem. You know, he's been opening his front leg a little bit. We can see that he's bailing just a little bit. He's flying open. So right now, he's starting to work on keeping his front shoulder in there. Um, but like I sit there and say, you know, everything takes a little bit of time. And you know, I told him, you know, if you, you know, keep your shoulder in. That's the same thing he said to me. I need to keep my front shoulder in there. And then, the, then actually, the mechanics will straighten out itself. Your swing will automatically straighten out itself once you're going to the ball the right way. Hey, the guy over your right shoulder, uh, is there any way to, I mean, he's, <laughs> man, he's like my child, man. <laughs> he's like my kid. <laughs> you know, we both Leos, so it's good. We both Leos, so we growl at each other all the time. <laughs> Can you help him hit? Oh, man, let me put it this way. With Jose, if he was hitting on everyday basis, he'd be one of our best hitters. And if he played in outfield, he'd be one of our top outfielders. That boy's an all-around athlete, and I love him. Hey, I asked Marcelo Zuna the other day what was the most important thing you had taught to him. That ball is a foul ball. And he said one word. He said patience. Yeah. What's up for Ozuna? You guys seem to, in spring training, really bond, and, it, and it's been a really nice relationship. Well, you know, it's like this. You know, some people want it. And Jose wanted it with me. He wants to be around me, and he trusts me. And, you know, like I told him, you can't just, you can't do it all at one time. You can't do it in one swing, and you're not going to save this team. We all got to do it together. You have to do your job, and you got to allow the man to do his job behind you. And if you're going to go out and give up at bats, then you're going to dig a hole, and that's not going to be a good job for you. You're a better hitter than that, and I believe in him, and he believes in himself now. Well, Barry, both of us, uh, you and I, come from baseball families. How did your relationship with your dad, him being a hitting coach, help prepare you for this role working with these guys? Well, you know, my dad was a very tough person, you know, and, he, you know, he expect, you know, the best out of you and stuff, and he worked you to death, and, and, and I understood that, and my dad had great eyes. My dad was really good with picking up pitchers, really good at seeing your flaws as a hitter, and um, I realized that, and I never left my wingman. <laughs> <laughs> Barry, thank you for your time, You're and we, we appreciate you coming on, and a nice job with the hitter, especially that uh, shortstop who's uh, really swinging it well. Yeah, thanks a lot, guys. All right, Barry All Bonds, right. Marlins hitting coach. As the Fish have a 1-0 lead here.